Smart Life, Matthew Perry, 54 years old, never met him. I met Joey once on the Friends. I don't know the ladies. Um, um, and Perry was very talented, I thought. I thought he was uh, extremely uh, bright. And he had it made. You know, the friend's success uh, was residuals. He didn't have any money problems for the rest of his life. But he was uh, a drug addict and an alcoholic. He says in his book, Perry does, he spent $9 million on addiction, 14 stomach surgeries, 15 rehab stays, therapy twice a week for 30 years, and then he bought all the dope. The booze you can buy, that's not a lot, but the dope cost him. So he's dead. And they say he drowned in his hot tub, which I don't believe for a second. Um, but I don't, they say also, the initial reports, there's no narcotics in the house. Toxicology hasn't come back yet. I have no blanket idea. What I do know, 100%, is that Matthew Perry is dead at age 54 again because he was a drug addict. See, you can kick it. You can get off it. But the damage it does to your body stays. So if you're taking heroin, fentanyl, methamphetamine, cocaine, all these powerful drugs up here and in your body, particularly your heart, okay, you're going to damage yourself beyond fixing. So this is why I put this in Smart Life. So it's not my job to be your keeper, but I want you around. Now, I know people who every night drink vodka or wine or whatever until they pass out. These are people who function the next day. I know them. They're going to die way before they should. Liver disease, whatever it may be. I guess they know that. I guess everybody knows it. If you're going to take illegal narcotics, particularly the powerful stuff, you're going to die. 54? He's off the planet? Now, a lot of people say, well, he had a disease. Oh, you know, there's a predisposition. It's in my family. My maternal grandfather and my first cousin died of alcoholism. Irish have a very high ratio of that. That's one of the reasons I never drank, because I was playing sports all the time and I was involved in other activities. Plus, I knew if I drank, I'd be in the penitentiary with my personality. So I, I just never bothered with it, ever. And I'm so glad. Not only did I say, and I tell this to the urgents, you know how much money I've saved by not drinking alcohol? I mean, cocktails now in an upscale place are 15 to 20 bucks a piece. You know how much money I've saved over all these years? And I can give it to the scholarships. So if you are trapped in some kind of dependence on substance, just don't do it. I know, I know it's easy for me to say, I know. But if you want to stay around, you got people who love you, you got to stop. Thank you for watching the No Spin News. To watch the full episode anytime on BillOReilly.com, please sign up to become a premium or concierge member. Visit BillOReilly.com to sign up and start watching today.